Hi, this is Rick, Vintage Oddball Cards. Today I have three cards I recently received in the mail this past month here. Um, these are uh, pre-war cards. Two of them are Hall of Famers that played with Ty Cobb in the outfield. The other one is uh, a manager who's famous for the 1919 White Sox, Black Sox scandal. He was the manager of the team. And we'll start with him. He's a, it was Tit, um, Kid Gleason here. Now, Kid Gleason managed the team from 1919 to 1923. He was not part of throwing the World Series, though. He did inform the owner, Charles Kaminsky, about what was going on once he found out. His name, Kid, his nickname, Kid, came from one, you can see here, he's not a very tall person. And also, he was very energetic, outgoing. Everyone seemed to like him when he was a player and a manager. After 1923, he went on to coach with Connie Mack and the A's. Now this card here is is pretty rare. There's only been five of these actually graded. The 575 of Kid Gleason. So that's the front and on the back here you can see it's a blank back. Next we'll start with the first Hall of Fame player that played with Ty Cobb and that's Harry Heilman. And this is the 1921 E121 of Harry here. Now this photo here is for him it's a famous photo of him. This was taken actually in 1917 the picture uh, of a news agency photo of him. So if you look up Harry Heilman you're gonna probably see this photo but it was uh, on his card here 1921 looks like he's in the outfield going for a fly ball. Now he he batted a career average of 342, four-time home or a batting champion. His nickname was Slug, and the reason for Slug was uh, he's one of the slowest players in the league at that time. Some say he would have went on to win more batting titles and have a higher batting average, but he was so slow that during this air, the dead ball air. He was not able to beat out too many ground balls. And again, you can see that um, this one here is has the advertisement on the back of the card. And then lastly, I have uh, kind of excited to pick this one up. It's the 1909 E90 of Sam Crawford. This is my first Sam Crawford card. He played along again with Ty Cobb in the outfield for many years. He actually taught Ty Cobb how to play baseball. He did not get along with Ty Cobb. Um, when Ty Cobb became famous, I think he became kind of jealous of him. Ty Cobb would get special treatment, uh, be, was able to uh, bunk by himself on the road, show up late for spring training. So they didn't get along for many years. Um, but he was a fantastic player. Probably nowadays you consider him a five-tool player, playing the outfield, speed, power, bat for average run. Um, fantastic player, Hall of Famer. His nickname is Wahoo. Um, kind of excited to pick up this particular card. And on the back, you can see that it has the advertisement. Kind of cool, of the advertisement here. So three cards, two Hall of Famers, one uh, famous for uh, manager, famous for something he probably doesn't want to be famous for. Hopefully everyone's being safe out there. I live in the Bay Area, not able to work for the next three weeks. Enjoy watching everyone's videos and and trying to make some content here. So thanks. This is Rick, Vintage Oddball Cards. Bye.